Hello everybody. It is December 23rd, 2018. Merry Christmas. I'm out here at the barrel today with my 1954 Evinrude Rude Fleet Twin 7.5 that I just finished up. Uh, I got this motor back in October. Uh, my buddy Ron Baker actually picked this motor up on his way to my house uh, for the a uh, Suter AOMCI meet back in October. And I bought it from him. And uh, we tried to start it when he was here. It uh, it pop a little bit but it wouldn't run uh, so we kind of set it aside um, when I got into it it had the original coils in it which were really bad shape and it had paper top condensers in it which were leaking uh, charge really bad so uh, I replaced everything in the ignition um, got new coils points condensers plugs plug wires um, rebuilt the carburetor with a carb kit and actually replaced the high-speed needle um, someone had put the put the wrong screw in to hold the uh, high-speed knob on and flared the end of it and messed it all up so uh, I replaced that and put the correct screw in it uh, did a lot of work on the lower unit on this one it uh, looked like someone had uh, not been shifting it properly the clutch dog was rounded off both forward and reverse and the drive dogs on the gears were rounded uh, so those had to be replaced and I put a new shift cradle in that was worn out uh, looked like somebody had been holding it in gear with the shift lever to keep it from popping out and they managed to bend the shift fork while they were doing that so that was out of, out of position so it wouldn't stay in gear so I had to bend that back into position and uh, resealed the gear case after that stuff was replaced. Put a new water pump impeller in it and uh, got a new power head base gasket and new lower crankshaft seal. And now we are running it in the tank, giving it a little bit of a test here and trying to get things dialed in as close as we can in 35 degree weather in a test tank. Anyway, uh, I'll fire it up and let you see how it turned out. As you can see, it starts well. Uh, just a light tug on it, and it rolls right over when it's warm. Pumping lots of water. Good snappy throttle response. Uh, the foot rattles on it, it's missing the little sockets that, uh, that the springs engage on the flip up side. So I'll get something uh, in there and help prevent that rattle by the time I get it on the boat in the springtime. But for now, uh, just trying it out in the tank, so it's okay. Thanks for watching. Keep your prop out of the mud.